get up there get up there lads we done did it let's go ahead let's pop up in this chest here nothing conspicuous or suspicious about it hey everyone welcome to our first terraria playthrough not including the stream and those single videos i made and i said i was gonna do a playthrough in modded terraria but our first actual playthrough we're doing master mode summoner the plan is to do master mode for all classes and i chose the hardest one first the hardest pre-hardened one first because i've been thinking about it excuse me i've been thinking about it and i'm like how am i gonna be wall of flesh as a summoner i've never done a full summoner playthrough before bro i'm just trying to break the trees guy please kill them this is my first summon right here dylan kill them please dylan there we go okay you can you can have the other one i just want the trees yeah i'm thinking about how is it gonna be possible we'll figure it out when we get there but you know what else we gotta figure out getting our first summoner weapon because if we don't get a finch staff from a living wood tree then that means we have to world hop until we do and that means that uh, well that's gonna probably take a long time to find what i'm looking for and the only way to start a true summoner even though i already did hit those slimes with my axe i mean i didn't kill him so it doesn't count until i kill something according to the bestiary most of the time unless it's gold critters because gold critters apparently they go on the be sherry sometimes even though i've never touched them before let's find this finch staff or we can't play the game well we could play the game we could set up like a whole lava farm but just think about that that's a lot of work of not killing a single thing and setting up a lava farm for slimes and also you'd have to find probably a slime statue to set up that farm but that's also the goal that's another side goal so let's hope that there's a slime statue i'm gonna be the very, very thorough searching but we got our living wood tree here and it's right on the desert like literally bordering the desert let's go ahead let's open this up here and early pre hard mode summer is still one of the worst classes in terraria i don't know how they had such a big update for terraria being 1.4 and they barely touched early pre hard mode summer obviously i can't see anything obviously the rest of uh pre hard mode summer is not bad but early pre hard mode is terrible i don't know why they turned the both throwing classes into range class or i guess the ninja set was that a crit class or crit armor something like that but i don't get why they did that and not just like make it a summoner set i know it doesn't really make sense was well, terraria a lot of things don't make sense but what's in here yes sir oh superior you love to see a superior finch staff let's get it we can actually play the class now something i've always been interested with the finch staff is how does it work when you get more okay let's be careful we're entering the desert uh oh there's a chest what the hell that's actually kind of really good luck but yeah i tried it before and it's just like more finches join the nest and they keep stacking up the, the more spawns you have the more summons you have and it's actually kind of insane okay i'll take an ancient chisel honestly that's not bad at all an ancient chisel for our first chest i would have taken anything else too but i will take that at the same time boom add it to the beast sherry welcome mouse yeah i don't got the beast sherry works sometimes we got butterfly and we got grasshopper i don't know how i thought you have, you have to kill some things and then sometimes uh oh do these guys have a lot of help they can't really get out so <laughs> let's see what we get what kind of magic we can work here we gotta get our beast sherry to 15 percent so we can get a whip from the zoologist that's the plan we kill some gnomes right there add them to the list I don't know if gnomes drop anything. But yeah, I thought it's you had to kill things, but sometimes you just unlock them for not even touching them. I don't know. I don't know why. All right, our next goal. Since we have a staff, we knock that out of the way really quickly. That's honestly that makes me very happy that we did that. I can actually build some houses early here and try to get a zoologist. And the goal after that is fishing. Fishing. So yeah, this is why I usually put my terraria. And Summoner is a lot better to play. There are a lot of classes allowed to play on Monetaria. I never played a vanilla Summoner. So let's see how we're going to do this. So the goal is to fish in the jungle, underground jungle. Uh, get the the very graded fish. Is that what they're called? Something like that. And then with those fish, we can actually, we can actually get more summons with the fish. And that's the goal. We get one extra summon and then just make a bunch of those and see how it goes from there. Look how long this takes to kill something. Oh my God. Just kill it. I'm going to die. Just kill it. Hit it. Oh my god, he took forever. I'm, a, I'm about to just summon him. Oh my god, I don't want to die. Don't die. Just kill just kill it, man. Let me get some trees set up while the finch is doing all that. Or let me get some houses set up so we can get NPCs moving. All right, daytime is here, I think. I don't know, it's raining. And the goal is to just get our beast sherry up and get the uh, zoologist moved in so we can get our first whip. And that's really it. I guess we're going to head underground too and try and get a slime statue. That would be very, very nice. And also the fish. We actually got a lot of stuff to do. I'm going to go to the left. I have some flowers on me just in case I see the corruption. And uh, we can go ahead and just attempt to stop it from spreading. Uh, we got a fish here. Kill the fish. The fish. 
We need them dead. We need all those beast share entries. All right, first gold chest here. Let's see what kind of goodies we get. Any movement type of stuff would be legit perfect to get. Come on. Ooh, Hermes boots early. Okay, that's gonna make getting around the world very, very easy. And we already have two NPCs in the forest biome, so we can set up a pylon, so I should save up gold to do that. Um, actually, I think I'm gonna go purchase, we got duck statue, I'll, I'll take the duck statue. I think I'm gonna go back right now and I'm gonna purchase the uh, piggy bank, just so we have it, because I wanna start saving gold right away. And I'm gonna take this piggy bank with me, because we're, we're saving gold out here. All right, so we got our second golden chest here. Ooh, watch out for that boulder trap. Second golden chest, what do we got? Okay, and it's violent. I don't know how useful that's gonna be to me. It may be pretty useful once you get a whip, but we got some insane mobility. If we get a grappling hook, then like we can legit move around anywhere early game, and that's really good. Look at this boy. That boy's spinning. Look at him. So I found a trick here with the finch staff. If an enemy can't move and they just get infinitely staggered and they're stuck in one position, then the finch staff will sit here and also be stuck on them. But if they're bouncing around, you know, getting knocked back, then it won't happen. And this is kind of useful information to have. And that allows me to play around with the finch staff and actually make it useful early game. All right, there's actually a web chest here. I don't see the stylus, which is who I really wanted was a stylus so we can get an ocean pylon. But chest, web slinger. Yes. Is this the only thing that's in this chest? I think that's the only thing you can, you can find in here. So very nice. We got the grappling hook I've been talking about. And we also had a hook right here. But we got the grappling hook. We got the double jump. We got the Hermes boots. We got everything. All right, we are going on a hunt. I'm going to find a slime statue. So this may be a lot of off camera time, but I'm gonna be underground looking for this slime statue because I want a slime staff. Plain and simple. The zoologist has finally moved in. I don't know where, where'd she move in? Oh, of course, way over there where I don't have a pylon. And look at my beast shirt. I got it at 11%, 11% just slowly hiding in boxes and trying to kill everything I can with my finch. And it's kind of worked out. Hold on, I might be able to get bees right here if I can hit that, hold up. Let's see if I can throw like a shuriken at it and hit it without, you know, getting hit too. There you go, and then block it off, boom. This has been the strat, kill him, get that bee entry. Look at that, where we at now, 11.54, yes sir. Let's go ahead, let's pop open this chest here. Nothing conspicuous or suspicious about it. There's straight up three dynamite traps, a dark trap and five boulders. This might this might be a little overkill. Watch this though, ready? I'm about, to, I'm about to outplay this. Break the dynamite, that's it, boom. Yeah, good one, good try. I'll be taking the free magic mirror. I'm here at the jungle. I know I can get the uh, jungle whip, but I kind of wanted to go through each progression point and get you know each whip but honestly i might just have to grab the jungle whip since i'm chilling here but also we're mainly here because i'm about to fish for some large very graded lard fish is that what they're called something like that if i fish one up i'll show you what they're called there you go very gated lard fish I'm just gonna fish up a couple thousand of these look at this kite i got look at that wow man eater kite kind of nasty looking but a kite is a kite it's still cool i'm here in the desert just picking off enemies to add to our bestiary and look at this 15 percent finally finally we can get another weapon to add to the summoner collection obviously the slime mission hasn't been going well uh, i've searched a couple of caves here but i keep dying in certain areas and uh a slime statue that's like one in a million if we will find one well i don't know how many statues there are but there's a lot of things that you gotta account for for trying to find one but it's all good at least we get a second weapon the slime statue that's still a priority but we get a second weapon it is from uh, the lovely zoologist here ellen please give me the whip see i don't know if it was 10 percent or 15 percent, but i was just being safe and going for 15 percent. but here we go leather whip your summons will focus struck enemies die monster for some intact damage 13 gold this is very expensive by the way thank god there was no bad reforge on it but look at this we finally have a secondary weapon oh my god i might be able to actually do something now oh hold up i got attacked right there my boy bones mcgee hold up finally you know how long i've been playing i've, I've just been chilling in it's not even like i've been struggling and playing I, i've just been sitting here playing terrary but i've been looking for this statue for a minute i've been looking for this statue for a minute we got it finally thank god our rng was actually kind of good for once what's in here Ooh. Thunder zapper. too bad i can't use it honestly i'd rather get the dune boots it's all good it's all good i'll take it because we got the slime statue that's all that matters and also by killing this guy we're getting our beast area up bro that boy just stole my kill bones mcgee if i see you stealing my kill again i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna kill i'm gonna i don't know 
But yeah, we got that. Oh, look, is the golfer. He's chilling over here, too. But yeah, we got the statue out of the way, which is honestly probably the hardest part. And now we're entering into phase two. I'm not talking about MCU either. We're entering phase two. I have to find a already preset up wire somewhere. And then we set that up. Boom, bada, bing. We can start farming the slime statue. Hold up, is that a Medusa statue too? I'll take this. I kind of don't want to be in the desert though, I'll be honest. But yeah, let's find a button so I can set it up. I honestly should grab some lava while I'm here. But yeah, grab some lava, set up a little farm, and let's get a slime statue. I'm hyped. Rest in peace, Jake the golfer i don't know what happened he just, he just died randomly but as i was searching around getting iron so i didn't have to return to the surface and i uh, made some buckets here i have this dart trap here that i broke recently and look at that we got a nice little area where we could possibly set this up in but uh, i have to go ahead and flood out this area so i can set it up oh there's one down here too that one might be better honestly let's see what i can do here let me see if i can flood everything out all right this is what i set up i don't ever do this so excuse me if there's poor optimization here but now we just you know press this over and over again until we get the slime staff which i don't know how long it's gonna take it's either gonna be real quick or it's either gonna be real long it's a very slim drop rate so can i see maybe maybe i have slimes in the bestiary open to that nope all right i guess i'll see you whenever lads we done did it we done did it if you can't tell from the gel in my inventory please leave me alone if you can't tell from the gel in my inventory we have it it took a while look how many stacks i have hey maybe we can get some good money i don't know how much gel sells for but maybe we can get some good money but well, we have it give me it i had a macro oh it's murders i had a macro on where I, I turned it off now so i can actually play the game where i had the space button held down and i put something to weigh it down and it would just keep pressing specs since we don't have no mechanical stuff set up yet you know this was the way to do it this was honestly the way to do it and i'm proud that we got it that's all that matters in the end we can actually continue the playthrough this first episode has probably taken me like hours to record i'm probably like four or five hours into this one episode maybe even more than that so i've been playing a lot but we have a slime staff can you believe it and we got gel let's see how much this gel sells for only what they're copper a piece so i can't even get a whole gold i'm saving the gel we're making a gel house what do i do now oh we got an evil presence watching us oops didn't mean to make that do you guys think i could kill the uh eye there's a possibility let me make an arena real quick let's see if we can do it i doubt we can we're talking about master mode eye here i don't have a full set of armor and i only have one summon but you never know you never know honestly let's see i i have faith honestly i have faith we might be able to do it hold up let's see if i can craft the uh potions here oh wait i do have iron skin and swiftness and all that hold up hold up i might be able to do something here we got this where's the moon glow where's the moon glow at i have, I have faith moon glow boom summoning potions made two of them let's do it let's see if we can do it how much how much damage the slime stuff does nine damage let's get a finch and let's get a slime and let's see if this is possible i, I do honestly have faith i feel it let me see if i make the arena a little bit longer i saw a lot of messages i was just laying down doing other things while uh that sounds sus saying that i was laying down in my bed looking at my phone uh while i waited for the staff to drop okay here we go buff up get the slime we got the finch we got the slime let's get it let's get it we have the movement we have the movement so we can do it. Damn. I, I kind of needed it to get hit by the eye. Or get hit by that star. How much health do we have? We got 300. That's honestly enough. That's honestly enough. Okay. Can we not have the other enemies hitting us? Oh, I accidentally activated a grab potion. I didn't know I had grab potions in my inventory. Kind of kind of bad that I did that. And no, that's all good. It's, it's not going to get me killed. And honestly, I could probably make it work. So here's the problem with summoner. The whips change aggro, right? I'm not actually really grab the The whips change aggro. So the fact they change aggro and you're using it constantly, it's making your summons lose their mind. Because they're trying to switch aggro 24-7. But uh, we'll see how this works here. I don't know if it's better having double finch or if it's better having double uh, slimes. I'm trying to kill all the servants. Get the servants out of here. L let's try double, double baby slimes. Let's see how that works. And I'll try my best to just whip the eye, but it's kind of hard sometimes. This is what I'm talking about. This, I feel like we're going to have a lot of troubles, especially once we get to the wall of flesh. Maybe some of these other bosses, it's not going to be too bad. But there, there's a couple of things we can get as a summoner. Primarily the uh, old one's army, Ballista. 
which I think I'm gonna get. I don't know. I might do the old ones on me multiple times and try and get different summons. See what I'm feeling, but usually the ballista is the way to go because it's a very good, very good weapon from the old one, old ones army. Okay, he's in phase two. Um, I'm kind of scared about this phase, honestly. We gotta get rid of the servants. He doesn't summon servants anymore, so we're not gonna have any more free health. So this this may be the time where we need our summons to step it up. Come on, my little slime bros, you gotta get in there. You gotta get in there. Okay, we might have to switch. We're switching to the double finch. Double finch meta. This is the new meta. Hey, at least we can whip all the time now. At least we can whip all the time. This is very very low DPS. I'm just hoping I don't get hit too often from his dashes. That's honestly all we have to avoid. And we should have decent movement speed. He hasn't done his crazy dashes yet. Thank God. Come on, Finches. <laughs> Hit him once. Maybe I gotta give him a little uh, a little push. As in, use my mana to summon him on. I don't know. They're really slow. It's making this really hard. Come on, just hit him once. I know that he goes in the floor a couple times, but come on. Okay, that's bad. We cannot have that. I can't really get hit at all or else we lose. I, I really don't know what some of these. <laughs> we don't have hornets. Oh man, we need to get hornet. We need to fight Queen Bee early. But the thing is with fighting Queen Bee early, she's kind of hard. So we gotta, I don't know. I'm so lost. I don't even have pants. I've been playing without pants this whole time. Not IRL, but like in game, I don't have pants. He's still doing the slow dashes, so we're good. We got enough room to run here. We might be at the point of no return here. With the I could do me dashing non-stop. Let's see, let's see what magic we can work. I'm rocking the, the slime and the finch again. See if that helps at all. We can't be getting hit. We could afford maybe one hit. Oh my god, we need a star to hit him. That would make my life so much easier. Oh, rest in peace. Oh, you like to see the grapple though. That was a clean grapple. If I had more floor to run on, this would be no problem. I kind of wish that you could drink like three summoner potions, you know what I'm saying? There's like three of them at once, and that's like the cap is three of them. I mean, I guess we got the bewitching table later on. I should try and see if I can cheese and get the bewitching table early. Because that would be, that would be a move right there. That would be a move. Okay, come on. I need, I need these slimes to stay on the platforms. If they stay on the platforms, look how much damage they do. They're doing great damage if they stay on the platforms. We got daytime coming. One of my slimes fell down there. He's dashing. He's dashing an awful lot. Come on. Stay high. Stay high. Stay up here with me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We good. We good. Stay up here. Stay up here. Oh my god. We're taking a lot of damage. We gotta go back to moving quick. Get up there. Get up there. Get up there. We're gonna choke. Get up there. Why am I having so much trouble getting up here? I'm not landing a single whip. Come on, slimes. Get in there. I need the slimes to do it now more than ever. Oh my god. We're about to die. You hate to see it, you really do, but oh my god, I blame the slimes, they weren't doing shit for me. I've been playing for a long, long time, including the AFK where I was farming the slimes and staff. And I'm gonna end this first episode here. We didn't really make any progress uh, in terms of, you know, the actual game, but in my heart, we made some progress. Now, we made some progress as a summoner. We have like pretty much everything we can get right now. And uh, we'll continue next time. Hopefully, I beat a boss, I don't know. I, I, I feel like I could have beat the eye right there, but I kind of got stuck right there for like a good 30 seconds. See, see you next time. Bye-bye.